This video introduces how to use the BOMC to create and update firmware for the Think System servers. Download the BOMC tool from the Lenovo XClarity Bootable Media Creator website. The OS for the BOMC tool listed is for your own workstation or laptop and is unrelated to the OS installed on the server. Run the BOMC tool with administrative privileges. Once the wizard starts, you can name your bootable media in the descriptive name field. In the targeted systems, choose the machine intended to be updated using this BOMC tool. In the acquire location, you can choose Update Express System Pack to obtain firmware for the server, then click Next. Set up HTTP proxy settings, default is do not use proxy, then click Next. In the target directory, choose the destination you want to download the firmware files to be safe, then click Next. Choose the bootable media device type. Use a USB flash drive as the bootable media, then choose the media drive path. Choose the do not use unattended mode if you will use the media through the XCC remote console. Double check and confirm the choices, or click save and obtain a file to save this configuration. The progress page will show the download progress of each individual firmware file and related update tools. Once completed, the BOMC tool media is ready to be used to update the intended machine. Choose Activate to mount the media and browse for the ISO file. After mounting, go to the bottom of the page and select the virtual media to boot at the next start, then reboot the system. Reboot the server and wait till it reaches the Lenovo splash screen. Leave the tool to start booting and wait for the start screen to appear. The tool will start searching for your specific machine updates. Once completed, it will present a list of all compatible updates, including non-detected hardware components that are compatible. Select Required Updates and click Next to proceed. Click Begin Update to start the requested firmware update. The tool will start updating the machine's requested firmware and will present the status of each update in sequence. Once completed, exit the utility and power cycle the machine.